This is Scott from KIG. It is February 24th, 2014. And this is a five ton coolant coolers chiller that we're going to run off here. This is one that has gone through a refurbishment here at KIG. Model HAV5000, serial number 11129. We're going to turn this on in a second here. Um, the unit's been cleaned, repainted. Um, we have brand new filters here. We've gone through it, leak tested it. Uh, you can see our sight glass right here, nice and nice and green. And this has a Man Europe uh, five horsepower. Actually, I think it's a five and a half horsepower uh, compressor. Coils are in really good shape. I'll put the air filter back on here. It's got a pretty hefty uh, two horsepower pump, a self priming pump with a little belly section there adjacent to the uh, impeller. And it's got a uh, cleanable uh, plate style heat exchanger here. We just have a, a space heater on here just to give it a little bit of a, a load as we chill. Uh, for this application to our, go to our customer, it's open loop per se. This is the suction side of the pump. This is going to come out to the customer's tank, I think about a 250 gallon tank. Um, fluid's gonna come in through the heat exchanger and then simply out discharging into the uh, customer's tank. This is the inside of the control cabinet. We do have some original manual and documentation as well as the manual for the brand new uh, controller we put on there. And this is the uh, main incoming power where the customer will wire in their, their 460 volt power. Okay, so all we simply do here is turn it on and our pump is running. It's the customer's obligation on a controller like this, and it is a simple controller, um, to not set the set point too low. And simply all you do, right now you can see the water is at 78F right now. And we are going to bring the set point by pressing set until the temperature comes up. We're going to bring it down to 50. as a differential of five. What that means is, and then you just turned on, you just keep pressing set until uh, it returns back, showing you the temperature of the process water. Um, and the unit's running right now, our fan is going. Our compressor's on, if you can hear that. By the way, that's our flow switch and the uh, pump pressure gauge within the piping. We'll come back to video number two here in a second as it gets close to our uh, our set point. Compressor running. Pump running. Side of the unit, by the way. And we're just starting to chill right now. So we'll be back to video number two momentarily here.